Candy Bus. All right, I'm at you guys again with a eBay haul. A one item eBay haul. Bad thing about you guys, they come in in ones or twos or you know. But this, let me make sure first how much I pay for it so I don't tell y'all wrong. Excuse me. Mm, I have something caught in my tooth and it's really bugging me. I paid 99 cents and I got free shipping. And this is the item. Can you see it? Oh gosh. I don't think you're going to be able to see it. Haha! It is a Betty Boop Swarovski crystal necklace. I hope you can see it. Let's try. Haha! -ha! There we go. And there we go. And I got this for my daughter for her birthday. Her birthday is in October. But. Um, she sticks and she likes jewelry and uh, I got this for her because I saw it and I just could not pass up on the price 99 cents there was some on there for like a quarter or whatnot but I wasted my sweet time and ended up not winning those so yeah, they had uh, they have a lot of good stuff on eBay, y'all. Stuff that you can get for a penny. Stuff that you wouldn't even never think that you could get for a penny. On the real. And I still have ten more items. I don't know last time I said nine, but I was mistaken. I have ten more items that I'm waiting on from eBay. And uh, one of which has just sent me an email today letting me know that they don't have it in stock. And I've been waiting on this item for quite some time now. And uh, what can they do to make me feel better? Well, uh, I went on there and I chose something on their site that's comparable, but it was $100 more. And if they don't get send it to me, then they will have to send me my money back within 24 hours. Or I will report them to eBay. So, I, I told y'all that's one thing y'all don't mess with. It's my money. But anyway, y'all was excited about this. Um, yeah. I should go ahead and just wait till a lot of stuff come in at one time and do the haul, huh? Don't think that's gonna happen. Because I've done, uh, what? Two now? Two? Yeah, I've done two. The coach purse and this. That's all I've gotten. That's all I've gotten. But, um, alright, I ain't, I ain't gonna trip though. I ain't even gonna trip. I'm, I'm gonna be patient. 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 Oh, look at, look at that. That's just a mess. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, Sharika got to do some more working out. She got to do some more working out. Because <laughs> my hubby don't got no problems with it. He say he like my curves. But what's so funny is he wants my waist to be tiny like it used to be. But he wants me to keep all of this and all of that back there. Because when we was in high school, because we're high school sweethearts. When we was in high school, I, my chest was kinda maybe half the size. Okay, y'all see? It was like half the size. And so yeah, he want me to keep that. That's so 
vulgar. <laughs> he want me to keep this and that back there because that was like half its size too. And uh, he wants my waist. He would prefer if my waist was the same size as it was in high school. But I don't see that happening. He doesn't care though because um, I've lost a lot of weight. He really did not mind me when I was at my largest weight, honestly. And oh! All you curvy divas out there, all of you, all of you that got a little meat on your balls, don't be ashamed. I was watching the news the other day, and they just did a study that says that curves on a woman act like an aphrodisiac that for men. Okay, they say that a curvy woman is the equivalent to a man of the high that they get when they're drunk. Which means, y'all curvaceous divas, get them in a little bit of something. <laughs> y'all make them stupid in the head. So that's a good thing. So, yeah, anyway. I don't know. Alright, that's my one item eBay haul. My teensy, 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 teensy haul. And don't forget to check out my... Uh, last couple videos, one about the Rocky Trading and the one about the swap. Watch those videos. They're very important. Alright guys, 